What's up? How are you guys? Another week down at Frankie's Free Range Meet, and I don't know what's louder, the construction and the train outside, or my guys working inside. Either way, it's uh, not the best cinematography. And I'm a little excited because we got some new products in today, and these next two weeks, especially compared to the past few months, we do have a few things coming in, restocks. I guess the construction outside is the louder culprit. <laughs> um, yeah, so we got a decent amount going on, but uh, first and foremost, the fresh beef share is coming tomorrow, as well as the restock on the fresh dairy product. So if you guys do want the fresh beef, this time around it is more affordable at $100 a share. And uh, we do have a few left, I think, if you guys want to get your hands on it. Uh, the butcher told me the meat looks really, really good. Uh, I'm guessing it's uh, nice larger steaks and it's pretty fatty, so you guys are getting a pretty good deal. And uh, we do have sheep milk in now. So if you guys want to try some sheep's milk, it's coming in small pint containers. Uh, that's the new dairy product. And uh, we'll show you guys uh, the two new things that came in this week. The meat should be coming later. I know I mentioned like uh, two weeks ago that we're going to have some beef stripe in for the first time and, and maybe a few other things, but it hasn't come in yet. So we're going to talk about that next week. Now the two brand new things this week is one, the quinoa crisp bar, and we have some artichokes, artichoke spread, as well as some whole artichokes. But first we gotta try one of these bars for you guys. Quinoa crisp. Uh, all the ingredients are on the website, frankiestrangefoods.com. I just have to get some uh, new labels made that have the front and the back. Now you guys know I'm always honest with you, and when I tried these last week, insane, phenomenal. The best bar that we've made, ironically, not the name best bar like the best out of one of my favorite out of all the ones we've made so good i was curious if the crispiness of the quinoa was going to stand up because you know when you mix the bar and the wet ingredients does the quinoa get filled with water too and not as crispy we're going to find out now these are so good these are so good it's a little less crispy, but it still has some crisp to it. Which I'm happy about because the brown rice did not retain like any of the crispiness. You guys gotta try these. You guys gotta try these. We made some slight alterations to the recipe. Uh, as you guys know, instead of the brown rice, we're using uh, puffed white quinoa. And we're using some walnut and hazelnut instead of macadamia nut. These are so delicious. These are so good. Highest quality. Fruit and nut bar on the market, delicious, all whole ingredients. Really, 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 really delicious. Also very calorically dense. These are like 300 calories each. You can't really eat more than one or two of them without getting really full. Even the aftertaste, something about that puffed quinoa, it's so delicious, it's so good. You guys have to try it. I might do, uh, if we have time to make some extra ones, I might, do a little giveaway in some of the meat boxes because they're so delicious. I want you guys to try them. So maybe we'll have some extra time next week or the week after to make a lot. Yeah, so you guys can buy these individually and we also have a package of 12 that's a little bit discounted. We also have these glass jarred organic artichokes, which are a very special product. And I'm happy to offer these at a very, very affordable price compared to everyone else online. So if you want the whole artichokes, and then you could like rinse the oil off and be like really picky about it, wipe them down and make them kind of just like plain organic artichokes or what's a little more convenient and what I've been putting in my uh, white bean puree for my noodles is the artichoke spread. You know, I'll just take a whole jar of this or a few tablespoons and mix it in with my noodles. So depending on how much work you want to put in, you guys can get the organic artichokes or the artichoke spread the description the volume and pricing and everything is on uh, frankiestrangefoods.com if you guys want more details on this yeah maybe in the near future we'll start selling the prepared products like the white bean puree and maybe even uh, just some organic grains as well but we'll see you know i don't want to go crazy buying thousands of pounds of grains and then uh, the demand isn't that high we don't really have that much space for it right now we are a little low on the biltong and the beef sticks uh, we still have some of the garlic herb ones, which I put on um, on a discount. The regular 
classic Biltong, two ounces we have some of, and then we have a decent amount of the eight ounce uh, naked plain Biltong. So this should last us another month or two, and then uh, maybe we'll do our own product line, not really sure. Those quinoa bars are so good, I might have another one. Like I just ate breakfast, so I'm not that hungry, but it's like a dessert, so you could eat a lot of it. So I don't think we have too much going on in the freezer this week. We did restock a lot of the lamb fat, and I put a little discount on it for you guys. So two pound lamb fat portions is $15, which is like half the price of any other lamb fat online. I showed you guys last week, we have the 80-20 the ground beef. That's affordable discount. Uh, we did restock some of the organ grind yesterday. We have a decent amount of that. Still have some of the 95.5 lean blend. This is actually what I've been eating. Um, in my beef stew and in my noodles at night. We do have plenty of the collagen broth over here. There's some of the beef stock over there still. And what we haven't had in a while is the chicken stock. So this is just whole chickens, roasted, a little bit of salt, mineral water, of course. Uh, so if you guys haven't missing the chicken stock, this might be a good time to buy it, but we should be getting some more chicken in a month or two, so we're not gonna be missing it for as long as we were. Yeah, looks like we're running low on the plain Iberico sausage, which people absolutely love. And then we have uh, some of the breakfast sausage, but they basically taste the same, guys. The, the breakfast sausage, I would just say, is a little more moist, not as dry. Beef share over here, we're actually uh, almost out of everything. So right now on the website, the beef charcuterie share is just one bologna and one smoked sausage. Uh, I think next week we're going to start getting rid of the snack sticks. So you're going to get like three pounds of snack stick. It's going to be cheap, like 15 bucks or something. But next week the butcher is going to do uh, one or two cows, all hot dogs, and one or two cows, all plain sausage. So we're going to be selling an individual sausage and hot dog share so you guys can buy one pound at a time. So that's finally going to happen. Restock some of the venison loin steaks. So we restocked our filet mignon as well. Don't actually have that much of it, so maybe we'll get some more this week. Eight ounce tenderloin steaks. Got some fresh skirt steak in too. One and a half pounds, two pounds. I think that's everything on the meat end of things. Uh, again, if you guys want the fresh beef share coming in tomorrow. In the fridge over here, we did restock the ginger and apple water kefir. Uh, this doesn't have to be refrigerated. We just keep it in here to kind of keep the probiotic content ideal. Some duck eggs left. We got some more coming in tomorrow. Got to restock some kefir greens. Maybe a little overstocked on the quail eggs over here. Yeah, we cut the prices on all of the eggs last week just to try to keep up with the demand because what happened was uh, when all the egg prices went crazy and everyone was buying eggs, like our volume went up and the farmers met that demand, but now it went back down a little bit. So we reduced the price trying to keep it up. So we'll see how it goes for another month or two. So I'm wandering around downstairs, not too much going on with the other businesses, organ supplements, kind of smooth sailing. Uh, we will be launching a kind of reiterated product in a week or two, hopefully maybe three weeks. Everything's in, that's ready. Wi-Fi shielding, as you guys know, I'm always wearing the stuff. We might do a few restocks on some certain things for Wi-Fi shielding. And then Frankie's Naturals, uh, we just restocked some of the clay shampoo and we might do like a whole new product line with new branding and stuff. Not 100% sure yet, but we'll see. All those businesses, guys, are on frankdestefano.com. Yeah, so if you guys want to help us out, make sure to order the dairy and eggs as well as the fresh beef as soon as possible. I mean, until we get an ice cream machine, <laughs> I'm, I'm throwing out milk, dude. Like it's, I mean, I don't, I don't know what to do, you know? It's only fresh for a few days after we get it and if people don't order it, I mean, and the farmer's producing the same demand every week, so it's not like he can cut back. So uh, I think uh, when, if we move, we're gonna get like a commercial ice cream machine. And then like over the weekend, when we see how many orders are placed and how much is left, we're just gonna turn it into vanilla ice cream. So that's the uh, somewhat short-term solution that uh, we're gonna have to jump on. But uh, those machines are expensive, so the commercial ice cream machine, so we'll have to see. But if you guys go to frankiestrangemeat.com, you will see all of our interesting and creative products. And uh, this week especially, we have the quinoa crisp and artichokes on frankiestrangefoods.com. I'm looking forward to, to expanding the product line and maybe doing some more stuff on there too for you guys. Um, and then you guys can see all the other businesses on frank But as always, guys, thank you for joining. 
drop a like on the video. Make sure to leave me a comment. Let me know if there's anything you'd like us to get. Subscribe and check that notification bell. And we'll see you guys next week.